A sister says, can a woman wear perfume and a little makeup in front of a suitor during the initial marriage interview conducted by her wali? We know that when a person proposes to a woman, he's entitled for an initial interview as part of checking one another to see if she appeals to him and if he appeals to her in the presence of the woman's guardian. So they may speak for half an hour, for an hour, chit-chatting, look at, at one, looking at one another in order to see if there's chemistry or not. And this is the first and initial interview. After that, either he proceeds in proposing and getting married or he declines and changes his mind. And this is halal in Islam. However, this interview is not to enjoy, rather to check one another. So it is not permissible for a woman to show her adornment and wear makeup, even light makeup, or uh, put some uh, cream on her face to hide some of the uh, pimples or scars or whatever, or to wear perfume. These are all prohibited because he's not halal for her. So all what she is permitted to do is to come to this meeting, showing her face, showing her hands, wearing normal clothes, which she usually wears. And some scholars say she can also expose her hair. And this is permissible, inshallah, but not to adorn herself. Because even if she puts light makeup, the suitor may say after marriage, oh, this is not the one I saw. You didn't have this or that. But when he sees her for who she really is, after that, anything she does is considered to be a bonus and a plus, inshallah, azza wa jal.